Good day, good day everyone. Uh, I'm not going to talk so long. Uh, it will be a short presentation in about me, myself, and my life, and which is connected with education. Um, I've heard many presentations which is connected related to education, how we should study, how uh, we should think of progress, yeah? and education that's possible for the future and things like this. And um, before educating, before learning to see, um, I always did a question to myself. Who am I? What am I? And what I am doing here? Not in the school of in the world. What is my destination? It is the main thing I think for human beings, every human being, to ask such a question himself. And are we in the right way? For example, our students who are studying here, they chose physics, mathematics, chemistry, or biology. Are they sure that they, are, they want to learn these subjects? Yes? Now, are they wrong? And this question always makes me to think about myself. Am I in the right way? Yeah? And I can say that I am a teacher. I'm an English teacher. Um, but this profession was chosen by my parents too. Yeah? And uh, we always say that uh, I had to study uh, for my future job, for my uh, brilliant future. I think the future is now. And how long should we wait for the future? We are from 25, we are 30. No, the future is now, and we have to try uh, to live in a comfortable life as everyone, everyone to, wants to live in a comfort life, uh, to make his life very uh, precious, yes, beautiful. But, uh, you know, uh, I, will, I always think of the one problem. Um, education is um, reducing. Uh, I, can, I want to say that literate people are reducing. Yes, right. We study, we go to school, after school we go to the university, we we'll take a degree, uh, maybe we take a diploma, yes? But a lot of people can um, use it in a proper way. Yes? Uh, we have a diploma, it doesn't mean we have public knowledge. And it doesn't mean that we can use it in uh, our life. It's amazing. And uh, as I said, that we are going to look at a comfortable and a good and a beautiful life. But. Um, the nature is losing its beauty. Yes? Uh, I always think of the environment that our nature is losing its beauty, is losing its precious, yes? And uh, we have a new party. I don't forget about deforestation. Do you know what is deforestation? The water is using the minerals. We are using them, using them, drinking, eating, but uh, we cannot reproduce them. There are such kind of things and we cannot reproduce them. Um, there are some examples. What is the deforest, uh, desertification? Oh, de not deforestation, desertification, how to prevent it, and uh, how uh, desertification occurs, yes? Uh, agricultural mis uh, mismanagement, overgrazing, overexploitation, deforestation, and everything um, uh, leads to desertification. Yes, uh, desertification means our earth um, is reducing the green space. The green spaces is reducing. Um, I think the main thing is water, water pollution, Air pollution, yes, as you see, it is our sea. Uh, our main uh, water appliances are reducing uh, year by year. And no fresh air, nobody. No fresh water, nobody. No green space, nobody, yes. And every time we are bleeding, uh, having a good progress or something else, we shouldn't forget about our nature, yes? 
Um, maybe we cannot do some a great change, but let's do a little simple things that we can. For example, keep environment clean, don't litter. Yes, use less stone soil. Try to um, ride a bike or go on foot somewhere. Do not waste water. Yeah, it's a magic of simple things that we can do. And in this way, we can help our nature. And if we save our nature, we can use our education or our everything, our wants um, to our life. Okay. Thanks for your attention. That was my presentation.